nature is an amazing thing. If you just get out of its way, it will do amazing things. Hi, I'm Richard. And I'm Ernie. And together with our three children, Maddie, Darcy and Callum, we run our family farm, Stone Ridge, just near Young in New South Wales. We produce lambs and we produce them as naturally as we possibly can using regenerative agriculture. Stone Ridge has been in our family since 1920. A lot of different enterprises over the years. Been a big sheep breeding enterprise. We've been cropping after years of conventional cropping using chemical fertilisers and herbicides and pesticides. Our soils were you know, practically dead really. We were doing what we thought we needed to do, but deep down, you know, we just knew that it wasn't right. Something that never sat well with me was the spraying when we were trying to make things grow. And then when we went down this change, we studied a couple of courses together, holistic management courses and things together, and it just felt right. The way I describe holistic management is being as soft as possible on your land and working with nature. We use grazing animals to look after the soils, to look after the plants, and that's the key. The, the animals are a tool that we use for landscape management. By resting the country and using the livestock in the manner that we do, it's given nature a chance to, to rebalance itself. You know, and that's the beauty of the regenerative farming. We're regenerating our soils, we're, we're bringing carbon back into the earth and storing it there. If you've got life in your soils and the, the nutrients in your soils, that then transfers into the, the grasses, the pastures that they're eating. The idea of having the stock, the lambs that are living out there and they're out in the paddocks and they're running around and they're not contained in feedlots. So their, their life is a happy life. That of course goes down that track of healthy soil, healthy plants, healthy animals, healthy people. Feeding the family you want nutrient dense foods. So foods that are grown organically, they will have higher vitamin and mineral content. The lamb or the beef, if it's grown grass fed, the fat content, the levels of the saturated fats, omega 3s and omega 6s, um, are in a much better balance. I think we need to get people thinking about where their food comes from. There's been a loss over you know, the last few generations of connection between the city and the country and we need to work as hard as we can to get that back. We, we have people come to us and say, you know, I remember sausages used to taste like that. Find out where it's from and who grew it and you know, you'll be amazed what you find when you start you know, searching out and, and talking to farmers and there's some great stories out there and, and there's a lot of people trying to do the right thing. We're managing our landscape in the way that we believe is the best and using the methods that we believe are the best and producing a, a product that we're very proud of 